lovely, lovely stuff. It is a true. Um, next poet up is, uh, we have only three remaining, so this is like a countdown of shots. Jessica. All right, the girl in the shots card. She's cute. I'm not gay, I promise. Go, Jess. <laughs> Okay, um, so I am going to do a rework version of my first poetry night. Um, it's a lot longer now and um, it's basically about my love-hate relationship with the city and the people in it. Um, so yeah. Um, silently silver clouds surfing, I slowly slip into this sparkling serpentine city. This sulfurous death trap, this slave driving demon that drives you to dementia, while diligently doling out karmic retribution and coercing and conking chiseling you into cradling your mind, your own menacing monster, and managing to amalgamate and propagate a pinched and pixelated phosphorescent picture of perfection that pulls you into its puzzling persona and pushes you to peruse and puncture, schmooze and restructure your life, your hopes, your dreams, while symmetry implodes and age erodes. It starts off with an inside joke, an insight into the inside of your mind, an inroad into your inside. And in time, I assume, they will be tied, your insides and mine, until being apart hurts more than being together, until the ink of your skin <coughs> rearranges to spell my name, until the ink in mine rearranges to spell out 42. 42, the answer to life, the universe, and everything in it. That's you for me. And in rewinding again, I'm rewinding again to the simple life, to the phenomenal feeling of finding your keys, to the calculated chemistry of creation, to the beauty of blind faith, to weaving through winding little lanes, to sunsets on the ceiling while I sink into my seat, to smiles like icebergs. Tight smiles, cleverly concealing what lies beneath the surface, to rivulets of rain running down the surface of my skin. Skin, so paper thin, but strong enough to hold your secrets in. Complete chiseling, contriving controversy, controlling contrition, contrition, sorry. We're contorting the cosmos, we're cosmic analyzing. Nuclear synthesizing, psycho energizing, comic synergizing. But far from the prism of your life, she's colorless glass and she won't despite. But will tease weave, tease weave a web of disease love. It's a better, it's a, it's a bitter scene <coughs> when you score. But the gold, the guns, the glory, they all slip between your fingers. And your singe, you're singular, but you don't want to be. Because you lust, you love, and you love and lust to live and learn. And if you're discerning and concerning, then you're yearning for more than they'll be ready to give. So you forgive and forgive and forgive till there's nothing left to forget. But you have all these regrets and remorse, and you can't find the source. And you're losing because you've forgotten that the game is the same. The players don't change, and the wolves in sheep's clothing have begun snoring because you're so far behind and there's no reason to rhyme and once upon a time you were mine.